community group leaders and teachers. I hope y'all are doing well, having a fabulous day. Hey, I'm excited because I get to introduce the Pastors Cup for this week, and this week we get to talk about coaching. So as we continue looking at vision and how that influences people and, and some, some growth strategies, I want to talk specifically uh, about assessing where people are at. A good football coach has a list. And on their list, they literally can identify every single player, what their strengths are, what their weaknesses are, and how to actually move someone from one level of, of influence to another level of influence. Um, specifically, you know, they, they can identify their A-level players, their B-level players, their C-level players, and they know how to move them from one category to another category. The same is true in effective community groups. If we know how to accurately assess where everybody in our group is at and how to move them from one level to another level, we're setting ourselves up for that much more growth and that much more opportunity to help everyone inside of our groups grow, to fall more in love with Jesus and run after Him more. Uh, I'm actually calling this concept moving someone from crowd to community to core. And so I want to challenge you over the next couple weeks, look over everyone that's involved in your community group and ask yourself, are they people that are more in the crowd? Are they more in the community? Are they people who are deeply in love with Jesus and know how to reproduce themselves as followers of Jesus? If they're not in that last category, try and help them find out how they can get from where they are to there and start thinking through and praying through what, what tools can you use to move someone to grow in their faith. Hey, I hope that's a great tool for you and I pray this week that you have a great community group. God bless.